In the world of supercars, the term Bugatti often exceeds its presence and is on the verge of hypercars. Nothing is conventional and nothing is simple, the attention to detail in every department is breathtaking and astonishing, although you come across it everywhere, still there are a lot of minor and hidden details of this mega car which will amaze you and increase your taste in mega car magnificence, undoubtedly in that list, the Chiron has a set of tricks and features in its own right. Here are the 7 things that you would want to know about the Bugatti Chiron. Upgraded Michelin Tires. For the speed test, Bugatti and Michelin added a layer of carbon fiber to reinforce the standard Chiron Michelin Pilot Cup 2 tires. The same tires, mounted to very light magnesium wheels, are expected to appear on the new Bugatti Chiron Supersport which costs $42,000 a set. Bugatti and Michelin has used plain test benches at 500 km per hour to check how would the jiggles, bumps, temperature and consistent torture affect the tires since it's on course to set the fastest speed achieved by a production car. Everything is made up of carbon fiber. A super strong, super light polymer with carbon. It has a naked carbon fiber body, leaving the black carbon fibers visible. The engine cover and the windscreen wiper are also made of carbon fiber. There's lots of carbon fiber trim inside the car too, along with Alcantara and leather. The body will also have orange stripes to match the prototype. Bugatti claims that if all the carbon fibers used in the construction of the chassis were laid out end to end, they would stretch the equivalent of nine times the distance between the Earth and the Moon. 578 horsepower quad turbocharged 8 liter W16 engine that has been nicknamed Thor. The car has 99 horsepower more than the standard Chiron and the same output as the Bugatti Centodici. It will have a 7 speed, dual clutch all wheel drive system. It's expected to go from 0 to 60 mph in less than 2.4 seconds. Bugatti produced two limited versions of Chirons called La Voiture and Centodici. Le Voiture Noire is a tribute to Bugatti's own history, a manifesto of the Bugatti aesthetic. Bugatti's Le Voiture Noire is the world's most expensive new car ever sold, $18.68 million. Only one will be built, and it won't be ready for its new owner for at least two and a half years. Bugatti plans to sell two custom-made cars every year, they debuted its one-of-a-kind $18.68 million La Voiture Noire, which translates to the black car, at the Geneva International Motor Show in March. The car pays homage to the Art Deco design of the Type 57 SC Atlantic, one of the most coveted classic cars in the world. Designed in 1934 by Jean Bugatti, eldest son of company founder Ettore Bugatti, only four were made. Three are accounted for while the fourth one, which was lost in World War II, would be valued at well over $100 million if found today. The new Le Voiture Noire packs 1,500 horsepower and 1,180 pound-foot of torque that propels it from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 2.5 seconds. It has a quad-turbo W16 engine with a top speed of 261 miles per hour. We produced a true one-off, a single-unit car that we call Automotive Haute Couture, said Akim Anscheidt, Bugatti's design director. It's not just a car anymore, it's really more like a piece of art in line with the highly exclusive fashion and luxury brands in France. The Bugatti Centodici, Italian for 110, is a limited production mid-engine sports car. The car is an homage to the Bugatti EB110 and a celebration of the Bugatti Mark's 110th birthday. The Centodici is 20 kg lighter than the Bugatti Chiron, and has a 8 liters, quad-turbocharged W16 engine, 1,578 horsepower, at 7,000 revolutions per minute. Production of the Centodici will be limited to 10 units priced at $8.9 million each. On August 2, the near-production version of the Chiron Supersport set a speed record as the first hypercar to break 300 miles per hour. It reached a top speed of 304.773 miles per hour on Volkswagen's 13-mile loop era Lessian test track in Germany. That means test driver Andy Wallace was going 5.1 miles per minute. 
The previous record, set in 2017, was held by the Koenigsegg Agera RS going 284.55 miles per hour in Nevada, but the new record isn't official since it's yet to be proved in a customer valid production Chiron Supersport. In normal operation, the Bugatti Chiron is limited to 236 miles per hour. If you want to head for its electronically limited 261 mph max, you'll need to activate top speed mode by inserting a second key, but it's not as simple as twisting the key and taking off. As Le Mans winner and Bugatti test driver Andy Wallace explains, the Chiron can actually shut you out off top speed mode, if the car doesn't find conditions safe enough for a 261 mph run, with the car's permission. It even checks the age of the tires. If everything is safe, the Chiron goes into low drag position, with ride height and the rear wing lowered, and front axle downforce reduced via the repositioning of two hydraulically actuated flaps ahead of the front wheels. Then you're good to go, so long as you're pointed in a straight line. Wallace explains that if you apply more than 90 degrees of steering angle, or if stability control or abs is activated, top speed mode immediately disengages, limiting you to 236 miles per hour. You can restart top speed mode by twisting the key again, but the parameters for automatic deactivation stay the same. The Chiron comes with a drift mode, Bugatti has come up with a mode for owners to drift their million dollar cars into power slides and smoke clouds. Based on the price of each tire set and maintenance of this car, that is the most expensive mode fitted to any car. For that Bugatti has a compliment for a fleeting moment, it's good to know that your jackets can be hung up on two high quality hooks behind the seats. Cool, isn't it? For more interesting facts and updates on the ever-evolving world of supercars and automotive industry news, stay tuned to us by subscribing and getting notified every time we upload new contents.